Hey guys, how we doing? It's me, Gloria, and welcome to my channel. Today I'm coming to you with a kind of cheery card to kind of lifting up someone's spirits and, um, you know, to let them know that, you know, enjoy, have a sunny day. So we are using the Doodle Charm cartridge. I'm also using this DCWV Glitz and Glam uh, paper stack and also this paper stack from... TPC Studios, then this one is called So Delicious, So Delish, Let's Eat, and this is a double-sided paper, but I'm using this side, so let's get started. My card is going to be an A2 size card, and I have this cardstock right here, and this is Basil cardstock, so this is five and a half by eight and a half, score at four and a quarter, and this is going to be landscape, guys, okay? So let's start decorating the inside. The inside, I already put the pattern papers. Oh. Oh, what a bummer. I've already put the pattern papers together. And as you can see, I have the sky blue. I got my pattern paper. Then I have my white uh, sentiment paper. And I end up stamping. And I end up using this uh, Autorandic Earth Tone called Steam. And I did this, so now I'm just going to adhere this right in the middle. So I hope everyone's having a really awesome day. Not doing too bad myself. Okay, let me bring you guys in just a tad bit. Okay, so for the inside of my card, I end up using this stamp set called Walking on Sunshine. And I end up using Have a Bright, Sunny, Sunshiny Day. And then I end up using also from my uh, Scrappy Mom stamp set. And this one is called Subway Sentiment Holidays. But all I did was just use this bracket right here. And I put the bracket on both sides. Then for the flourish, I end up using this Inky Dicky Do one. And this is the one that I used. And this is Dot Flourish. And I used this one and I inked it right there. And as you can see, it came out pretty cool. I just love it. And then it's awesome using different color inks now. And the reason why I hesitated earlier at the beginning you see right here it kind of smeared a little I kind of put it upside down but it wasn't dry obviously okay so then anyway there goes the inside of my card have a bright sunshiny day so let's start decorating the outside of the card now for the outside of the card I have The blue cardstock and my pattern paper. And I'm going to adhere this right there. And I already stamped my sentiment in it. And it says, and it's from the same stamp set also. It says, it's your day to bask in the sun. So I stamped it down here. It's your day to bask in the sun. Have a bright sunshiny day. So you see how the sentiments, they both go together. Now I could have used the steam uh, ink, but I didn't think that it was going to come out quite bright. So I just used uh, the very fine, uh, VersaFine Black Onyx ink. Okay, so then now I have a four and a quarter inch by three so four and a quarter by three and I'm going to adhere this in the middle and I already have it backed up with a pink layer card stop so I'm going to attach this and I want to go you know I'm just going to put it straight on the top because I wanted to give a little bit of more room also to my cut that I'm going to put down Okay, so there goes. So now, 
on Mrs. Kate's Cuttables in the 50 cent store I end up using okay give me a second I end up using this file and this is the file that I end up using and as you can see it's in the 50 cent store and it's called Beach Borders and let me back up hold on a second it's called Beach Borders and then as you can see they have different kind of borders they have a sand border, a grass border, a palm tree border, bare feet, water waves and clouds so what I ended up doing was I used a cloud border and this is what I ended up cutting out. So I ended up cutting out three of the cloud borders and I did them on three different colors. White, white uh, glitter but three different colors of the blue because I wanted to give it a change. And I have one of these on foam tape. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to add one up here and one right there and then I'm gonna add my other cloud and it's gonna be popped up and as you can see how cool it's coming out okay so let me get my glue And this cloud cut right here is so stinking cute. All the borders that she came out with this week are so stinking cute. I just I, I just love her files. They're so easy to work with too. So now I'm going to take... I think I'm going to put the blue one out first. So I'm going to take my glue t uh, quick dry. Just give me a second. Okay, so now I'm just going to adhere this down. Like right there. Then I'm going to adhere the other one down. And I'm just adding glue to the back of this. Then I want to put this one on this side a little bit close over here. Right? Oh my god, it's already looking so cute. Then I have another cloud that's going to go right on top of here. But before I put that down, I end up cutting out out of Doodle -doo Charms this sun and I cut the sun out at two inches by three and a quarter and here goes my sun I end up using the Moody Face Assortment PK 1200 and I use this face right here and I thought her face came out so stinking cute I end up using a blue gel pen and a white gel pen or a blue glitter pen with a white gel pen and I did some cheeks and I put some freckles on her face I used some glossy accents and I also popped up this uh, cloud I mean the sun so now I want to attach my image right there but I want to kind of put her in a slant so in order for me to do that, I need to add some, because I want to add her flat, because I have that other cloud that's popped up. Okay. And 
and I think she will look right there okay oh my god she came out so cute you see what I'm talking about guys these faces are so stinking amazing I just love them and then I'm gonna add this cloud right down here and since I got this on foam tape I'm gonna take this off Okay, so there it goes, guys. And I actually probably be able to oh, that looks good right there. Okay, guys, so there goes my card. It's your day to bask in the sun. Have a bright, sunshiny day. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Definitely give this video a thumbs up. Letting YouTube know you like my video. And also letting other subscribers or viewers know that you like my video also. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please press that subscribe button. I so do appreciate your support. And I hope you enjoyed my cart. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye now. Her face came out so stinking adorable.